everybody, welcome to episode 3 of the Pokemon Sword playthrough. Ah. Why do I always forget to connect the controllers beforehand? We have got a Dynamax band and our Pokedex, and now we are going through the wild area to get to the fire type gym. Even though we have to take a longer journey to get to the grass and water type gyms before we can actually battle in the fire type gym. Oh look, the professor's assistant came. As you can see, this is getting off to a pretty rough start. Now let us go so I can find some awesome Pokemon. I never have to go to a Pokemon Center for that, and I realize that now. Huh. I have to go to a Pokemon Center for jobs, though. Oh, I still have the wishing. I still have the wishing stuff. And I can get a Pokemon box link. Okay, I really have no idea how to use that. Is that what I? Oh great, I can't catch this one. It's above my catch limit. Right now my catch limit is below 20. And he's just at level 26. Okay. Apparently I'm supposed to run. Score bunny! Should have chosen run. Because I happen to choose his next Pokemon. Phew! But I lost one Pokemon. Okay, I'm getting back here. Coming to this lady. She can rest my Pokemon. She considers herself and she and her older sister consider themselves a full-time Pokemon service. I don't see any beams of light. Oh, I see a few. But I don't see any purple ones, which means there are no rares. Ah, dang it. Okay, for this we're just going to travel across. Oh, another note. Wider view, much better. A Vulpix.
I'm gonna try catching this one. No, quick attack was disabled. Tackle. Oh, isn't he the copycat? Oh, wait, no, that's a she. Oops. It should be in the red zone if you want to catch it using a Pokeball. Usually, yeah, that is. But sometimes you can get lucky. Like right now. See? I got lucky. I caught a Vulpix. Let's go. Now. What's its level? What's its level and what's its gender? I can't tell. It has both genders. What if that happened? New. Yeah. Now, Pokemon. Vulpix, check summary. So it's a girl. Original trainer, Kevin. Type, fire, name, Vulpix. ID, number, one nine four six four one level nine huh. it's already in the top four boy that's close Why not? I'm just gonna run straight there. Traveling across this place without a bike is gonna be harsh. And later in this game, you get a bike. Isn't that fun? I gained 300 watts. <gasps> it's a Triogu? I think. Don't invite others. I think it's a Triogu. I could be wrong. Or whatever its name is, I could be wrong about it. It is a Triogu. 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 So its name is Triogu. Max Strike, Max Guard, Max Flare, Max Strike. Max Flare, what do you think? It's the best. Especially against the fighting too. I wish I knew Max Air Stream. Wrong. Oh. oh. Kevin school when he used Max Flash. It's not very effective. It's effective. Pikachu used Thunderbolt. Uh, um, a fighting type's weakness is. Um, 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 I think it was flying types? Yeah, flying. Fighting types weakness is flying types. Wow, that was nice. Max strike! Knuckle the stop, change the bed, yeah. How does it get to use Max Knuckle again? Wait, no, that's Max Strike, Max Knuckle, something very different. Use Max Strike! Use Max Strike already.
fire left. I'm using a Pokeball now. I know you can dynamic you can make a Pokeball gigantic without a Pokemon being inside. And that's how you catch a Gigantamax or Dynamax Pokemon. You have to catch it. It's against the game's coding to not catch a Pokemon from Max Raid Battles after you defeated it. I need to see it to level before I decide. And I got XP candies that I might use on it. Level 17! At my current standing, that's a very good Pokemon. And I think I'll use the level ups on any grass type I have. Or I might just use them on Score Bunny. Yeah, I think I'll use some of them on Score Bunny. Some of them on grass types to prepare for Nessa. So hard to defeat her. But her gym mission is quite easy and fun. Shall I dare say fun. Be back. Ah, deal party. I have to get rid of one of the level eights, but I don't want to get rid of Trudel or Zigazoo. Zigzagon. Zigazoom, zigzagon, zigzagoon, zigzagoon. I don't want to get rid of zigzagoon or Trudo, but they're the weakest ones. The Emperor I need for the water type gym. And Rookity, Rookity is just awesome. I mean, it evolves into a Corviknight, and then it gets air type, and then it gets air type moves which will help me against the fighting type and the rock type gyms. Vulpix is just, I mean, it's a fire type. It's gonna help me with Milo. Which means I can focus all the level ups on Yamper. And Scorbunny, oh, come on, he's my starter. I'm not gonna give him up. Plus, he'll help me a lot against Milo, the grass type gym leader. So, I'm thinking. Water type doesn't come in handy until I do that, and still, it doesn't come in too handy. But the dark type is even worse, so I think I'm just gonna get rid of the dark type. Where the heck am I supposed to be headed? Oh, there. Can't go any faster than this. Uh oh. I think I whistled. I'll save these XP candies for later. Did you see, did you see that? And I think the energy is called Galar Particles. Look, I'm walking up a ton of stairs. My legs are gonna be so sore after I do that. Wait, they're not my legs. They're virtual Kevin's legs. Okay, sorry about that. I accidentally knocked my camera. Wow. 
this is Moscow. Well, that's how I pronounce it. Register at the Pokemon Center. I was going in that direction anyway. I planned on doing it. I can customize my league card. Leon's league card. Finally, I can rest my Pokemon. <laughs> We're a Pokemon near Wedgger Station. I'll never be able to catch them. I don't know how that happened because I went sideways, but um, it happened. I got XP candy all around here and Dynamax candy. Using this on Yampa. Using all five. A level 11? Yampa, yeah, learn die. Level 13, that's two levels. I wanna get all of them to level 10 or above, so I think Rookity should use the rare candy which levels you up by one. And Dynamax candy goes to Shumper. Oh wait, should probably customize my league card. <laughs> hey, Leon has a background? Uh, I wish I could be champion and I would get a background of myself. Blank. Pink, blue, black. Nice pattern. I don't know. Where am I looking? This might be someplace in Hammerlock or Moscow. Or
think this would be the best. Cheetah fur, bubbles. Yeah, I think this will be good. Frame. Um, let's see. I think I'll prefer black. To the next step. Print it. Hey, the cards are even waterproof. Nice. But it's virtual, so it's not like it can. Blah, blah, blah. I'm here for the gym challenge, dude. Now I gotta go to the opening ceremony. Oh, so it's gonna be held in the fire type gym. I think last time it was held in the water type gym. Time before that, the grass type. Time before that, the dragon type. But never once has it been the duck type. And that's because it's not a big stadium. It's just a small room. Piece of charcoal. So I got this thing before I started the time. And I leave it with my cinder waist until the very end. Ooh, this is tiring. Charcoal, give it to Score Bunny. Oh, come on, Hop. I'm trying to get to a mean ball guy. Let's go already. What number should I be, guys? I don't know. I'm thinking six. If you agree to that, give a like to this video. If you disagree, give a thumbs down. Although thumbs up would help a lot and it's completely free. And no, I don't actually get paid for that. It's just nice to see. And I get the, the play buttons. First play button I need around 1,000 to 1,000 or 10,000 subscribers. I don't know. Just 
you see that? Mm -hmm. Apparently, I don't get paid for subscribers, and I don't really care. I don't get paid for much of anything. I just like playing video games. Chit chat. Should it be one? Because that's actually Leon's number. But I'm thinking along the lines of six. get started with this thing apparently I'll be doing the gym challenge on episode 4 this is episode 3 and I'm going to the bird drew drop in oh my god I know my way dum dum it's literally right next door I just had to walk like five meters. I don't need an escort for that. No, it's so weird. I choose the language to be English and then all these labels on all the shops, stores, and buildings happens to be in a different language. And I don't know what language. So we're just going to continue, continue, continue. Oh, this is tiring. Chit chat, chitty chitty, chit chat, chit chat, chit chat, chitty chitty, chit chat, chit chat, chit chat, chitty chitty, chit chat, chit chat, chit chat, chit chat, chit chat, chit Stupid team yell. This will be the battle of the day. After this, we will be concluding episode four. No, episode three. This is episode three, right? I'm getting so lost. Blah, blah, blah. You stupid You see this team yell grunt? I'm going to destroy him. Apparently he has a zigzag, a zigzag. So I know how to deal with him. Quick attack. Oh, it's a level nine. It's a lot stronger than the one before. And how do you deal with this? Ah, I have a paralyzed heal. Oops. Quick attack. It's down to lower than half health. And I wasn't paralyzed this time. It's awesome. And I win against this brute. Even though he's actually a grunt, not a brute, I think. The team your grunt is defeated. Ouch. Is there such a thing as stubbing your knee? Because I think I just did that. Okay, now I have to defeat this guy too. What if I have to defeat all four of them? 
forgotten what happened in episode one if you don't know what happened involving a naked in episode one then you should go back and check it out but naked is my mortal enemy and it's evolved form too thievil by the way thievils have mustaches Looks like you're not wiping the floor with me. Looks like, so, you know they wipe the floor with their tails, and this is very trash talk. So looks like you're the, so it looks like I'm the one doing the wiping now. If I have to defeat all four of them, it's gonna take a long time. It's a two on two. We're gonna absolutely destroy them. <gasps> nick it! Nick it, nick it, nick it, nick it! I'll take care of this nick it using quick attack. This one's stronger than the one, last one. Oh look, zigzagging. Oh, uh, that's what happened. By the way, for select, you can use ZL or ZR. By the way, if you link three controllers, then you can use. Then if one of your controllers falls out of battery. You can use a substitute controller. The third controller is a substitute. As long as it was the same type. Because if it was a minus that died and you have an extra plus, then um, it's really not going to work. You're going to have two plus controllers. Emergence Nugget. Die, Nugget, die. Oh my god, I really... Okay, next I'm going to use Quick Attack. Still going to use Quick Attack next. Yes, I'm going to use... I'm going to use Double Kick next. I'm forgetting Growl. And then to learn Pyro Ball, I need to forget Headbutt. That's later on when it becomes a single race. Apparently, Kabu is supposed to be like this big awesome guy, but he's really the third gym leader and he's not really that good. He's easier to defeat than Nessa, the water type gym leader who came before him. Few people make it to him. Fewer pass. I don't get it. How is he so tough? He's so easy for me. Not a lot of people made it through the tournament. Bead, bead, the fairy type gym leader. You'll get it soon. Marini, she was named after a Pokemon, and apparently. She is their boss. Actually, Team Yellow is the posse of the Dark Type Gym Leader, the seventh gym leader. So, they only cheer for her because she is the younger sister of him. And she eventually takes over as the Dark Type Gym Leader. That's after she gets into the final tournament to try to become the champion. Well, I think she becomes a dark type gym leader, maybe. I mean, that's what her brother Pierre's wanted. And that concludes 
the third episode. Goodbye, everybody, and good night.